right time for our Hurley Medical Center play of the night. We go back to Bridgeport here. Darnell Jackson gets the pass, and Ben Forty says, hello. Oh, what a big hit right there. Let's take another look at this one. Maybe get a little sound up on this, would you? A little sound here. All right, let's take it one more time here in slow mo. Yes, Ben Bordney, you are our Hurley Medical Center play of the night. Of course, Friday Night Lights brought to you by uh, Isabella Bank each and every week. We want to thank Tropical Smoothie for our ticker sponsorship. And, of course, Tri-County Equipment, the Game of the Week sponsor. Make sure to vote this week. Hey, want to give a big shout-out to Saginaw Arthur Hill picking up their first win in two seasons. They went winless last year. Roll the Coach, band. Coach Peoples told me a few weeks ago before the season started that we're going to be better this year, Jason, and they beat Flint High tonight, 40 to 16. And how about Sandusky crushing Brown City, 50 to 6. DeLoren Wedge, 14 carries, 270 yards, and five touchdowns. That's not too bad at all. Cass City out in the thumb wins a big game against USA tonight, uh, 13 to 6. How about the big matchup between Laker and Reese? It goes to uh, uh, Laker by the score of 18 to nothing. And how about Claire? They beat Alma with 35 to nothing last week. They get off to another great start here against Gladwin and uh, beat them by the score of 55 to 28. We're going to be keeping our eyes on the Pioneers this season, that is for sure. Week three of Friday Night Lights next week. That means we reach the one-third of the way part of the regular season. That's it for Friday Night Lights week two. Join us for week three next week right here on TV5.